This is a valve lifter and in today's video I'm going to tell you what you need to know about it. How this works is the camshaft pushes the rocker arms and the rocker arms have the valve lifters inside of them. The rocker arms push the valves to either open or close and if the valve lifters go bad this is what the car sounds like. you see a car or you hear a car making that type of noise it's not normal for a car to do that i was able to fix that problem by buying valve lifters and i installed them in the car first i had to prime them and then install them back into the car and i've never had a problem ever since So if you have a valve lifter, you'll see that uh, it has a hole inside um, or at the back and at the side it has another hole. So this thing needs to be hard as a rock. You cannot push this thing into the cylinder. So if it's like this then it's primed. If your valve lifters make noise it means that they're not primed, you have to prime them. One thing that I would like to add is that if your car stays for too long not running or you don't start it every two weeks and or after a few months you don't start it that makes the valve lifters release the oil that they have inside and when you start it it makes a chunky sound and i hate it and if you do that um if you don't start it like uh, uh regularly then that noise is going to be permanent because the valve lifters are going to get damaged and they're not going to work as um they were they need to get to be primed every now and again and the car primes it primes the lifters itself when you start the car all the cars they don't have valve lifters they have uh, adjustable um valve lashes you adjust them uh depending on the gauge on your filler gauge i'll show you a picture right now this is a filler gauge and it has uh, markings there which shows you how much distance there should be between the valve lash and the valve uh, and the valve itself just using your screwdriver and a spanner and then yeah those are for old cars but newer cars they have different uh, valve lifters Hondas have different valve lifters you know all of them but you have to check um, the car itself for me I did research and I couldn't find any information on this Ford Ranger I had to look up um, a Mazda, a Mazda B2200 and I was able to find information on that and even when I was buying the valve lifters I couldn't find the ones for this car I had to you know be smart about it I, I saw okay the valve lifters on the B2200 is the same as that of this car so I was like to the person who was looking up the part number or the valve lifters in the store at AutoZone and then I told him look up for Mazda and then he was like able to find them because for the Ford Ranger I couldn't find them but for the Mazda I was able to find them and then I bought them and then I put them, put them in the car and this is how it sounds so hopefully this video was able to help you guys anyone who was having this problem or know someone who has this problem where their, their car is making this valve lifter noise so if you found this this video informative make sure to like and subscribe to Envision Cars SA so that I can make more informative videos for you guys and yes I'll see you on my next upload